morning everyone. Rosie Hallandale here, sitting, drinking my OJ at my favourite cafe on the London Sims. As you can see, oh, I must improve my camera skills. Speedy Signage Bar and Cafe and if you notice the address, Baker Street 221B. All Sherlock Holmes fans will love this place. I'm not sure if someone actually lives here or whether it's just a showcase house but I think it's a showcase house because it's made up exactly like you would in the Sherlock Holmes series if you've ever watched the series so it's really well decorated on the inside just like in the TV series. Anyway, I digress. Oh, and this is inside the cafe. Look at this. My favourite cupcakes. Yum yum. Now today I wanted to show you what houses are available for rent on the London... Oh god, these... <laughs> I've got to get my camera skills up. Okay. I wanted to show you uh, what's available for rent on the London Sims. It's one of my favourite places and I guarantee once you rent somewhere here you'll not want to leave. Well that's ha what happened to me about mm, coming up for four years ago now and I'm still here and there's been a lot of changes on the Sims over the years and I can honestly say that the way the sims are at the moment is the best they've ever been so it's a good time to come along see what's here and to rent a home and to live here I'll just finish up my drink so yes I know what I was going to do I was going to show you the map okay it consists of three sims we've got London Mayfair London, England, and Knightsbridge, and I'm currently on <coughs> the streets of London Mayfair. That's the map. Oh, I'm gonna put my OJ down. Okay, then let's get going. <laughs> several bots around the sim. This is one of them and it's always stood here in the middle of the road. God knows why. Oh, my driving amazing. Right, I'm going to find a show home along Bayswater Road. Haha, <laughs> sim. Crossings are going to be fun. There's one coming up just about now. Yeah. Here we go. Survived it. There's various different styles of houses, lots to choose from. And they're all, all mostly about 400 lindens a week for around 250 prim. And they come furnished, well some of them come furnished, these particular ones come and come furnished. If you don't want the furniture, then you can have the furniture taken out, of course. The ground floor. The kitchen. And the 
two further floors. Balcony. Lovely views over the park area. And then we have the top floor. Next up. I'm not going to go in each and every house as that's going to take too long. Where did my car go? Oh my god! Someone's stolen it! Oh. Well, sorry about that. Um, luckily it was just a hire car, so I just went back to the people I rented the car off and they gave me another one, they gave me this one, and they can sort out it being stolen. I just, I'm just flabbergasted. Um, it's never happened before. Anyway, I'm um, sat outside another one of the houses you can rent. I won't go in this one, but you can see it's got a basement and a further two floors. Okay, so let's move on to the next set of houses down here. Ooh. Well, this one's hard to handle, this one. Really fast. Okay, we've come across to some more houses. Um, this one has a show house. We can have a look around. Dare I get out of the car? Let's risk it. Um, they come furnished again, look. Look at this. It's just an example how nicely it can be furnished. I'm sure if you rented here, they'd let you keep the furniture if you wanted to keep the furniture. Yay, my car's still here. Right, let's move on. I really need a chauffeur or something. <laughs> come on, come on, I want to get around this corner. There we go. Oh, round to the pavement. Great. Just need to park up. Oh, lag. These are like the Bayswater houses. Slightly posher looking, I think. Layout in the inside is the same though. On to the next one. Here we have yet another style of home. Attic room. Bedroom. Lovely full poster bed there. Tastely decorated living room. Separate dining room. Oh, and a gorgeous kitchen. Around there, and now I'll show you the biggest houses that you can get the luxury houses. 
see if I can find a showroom, I mean show house, one of these. These seem to be the most popular, the bigger ones. Most of them seem to be rented. Has that one got furniture in? Ah yes, looks like it. Let's have a look round. Entrance lobby, dining area, luxurious furniture, and here's your kitchen. Wow, look at that! Loving the kitchen. You can do get something from the fridge. Ah, oh, yeah. I think I'll help myself to a snack. Don't mind if I do. Mmm, tasty. That's all my five a day sorted. Oh, that's a nice fireplace. Liking the furniture. Ah, oh, chess. I love playing chess. As long as I win. <laughs> Ooh, moving swiftly on, the lounge leads into the conservatory. And upstairs, lots of space up here too. Luxurious furniture throughout. And all at a reasonable price. Rosie, how much does this all cost? I want to live here straight away. I hear you cry. Well, we'll pop over to the estate office in a little while. There's just one more property I want to show you. Cozy little place, you're gonna love it. Taxi rank, if you like to take a taxi, you get a tour of the Sims. Now these homes, they look really good on the outside, nicely textured, cute and cosy I'd call this, lots of little rooms. Let's go in and have a look round. Lovely view out the back over the park. Very nice. Right, I'll head on over to the rental offices now. Okay, see you there. Hello, here I am standing outside the rental offices on the London England Sim. Here inside you'll find all the details about renting a house or even renting a shop here and all about living on the London Sims. As regards price, there's basically two tier levels. You've got the big mansions which are obviously the most expensive and then all the other houses are basically the same price. Um, the big mansions are 999 lindens a week and all the other houses are 399 lindens a week and they all have the same offers on if you pay for five weeks in one go you'll get the fifth week for free. 
every house comes with its own parcel and which means you get full privacy and security you can also set your stream so you can have what music you like in your own home and residents are able to res their own car like I did so you can have fun trying to drive around the streets so I highly recommend that you come down here I'll put the URL link in the description below to the rental offices and I think in my next video I'll do a more detailed tour about what you can find at the London Sims and I hope you look forward to watching that and uh, hope to see you again soon okay thanks bye bye